Oh, yes. Okay, so I just had a bad idea, uh, possibly an expensive bad idea. I was wanting to drive my RC car around. It's a Latrax, but uh, I wanted to wear my goggles so I actually could have more fun. Uh, but then I thought like, well, I could buy a DJI 03 air unit and strap it to it, but that's like 180 bucks. And then I thought, wait, what if I just set my DJI Neo drone on top of the Latrax car? And so uh, I figured, let's give it a shot. <laughs> this, is, this is probably gonna be a bad idea. Let's grab the drone and see if we can make this work. Mm, 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 mm. Okay, so I've got the Neo here. Set the camera down. Mm. Okay, so I have the Neo. No okay. good. And the Avada. But I think the Neo is probably going <laughs> to... Uh, I hope that's all right. Uh, so let's strap the Neo to the top of it. It's a little cheaper and uh, much lighter and smaller. So... Oh. I'll need other tools out of there in a minute. Ooh, I like the goggles. Let me show you the goggles too. So, got a controller, which I won't need much of, but a little bit. And then of course the goggles to go with the Neo. And then I got to find a Latrex. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. So we've got the Latrex here. Latrex. Okay. Set that aside. Uh, I think... I think the battery will be charged enough. Okay. So let's test this thing out. Okay. That's the front. I don't think it's going to make sense to have the cover on. It does look kind of cool. <laughs> I don't love the way it sits on there. Let's try it without the body shell. Okay. Put it towards the back. I'm afraid the front of it's gonna get into the camera. I guess we can try propping it up there. Maybe. Maybe. Oh. Oh. Check that out. These little points right here slide right into the vents for the props right here where my finger is. So I can set that right inside of there and check that out. Oops, maybe this side might be easier to see. And so I have the base of the drone actually sitting right on top of this little cover over some of the electronics. That sits pretty steady. Has it looked? Does it look cool? <laughs> okay, uh, so strapping it down, uh, well, it's either tape or zip ties, right? You, even though I'm team tape, I think zip ties might work. The only thing I'm concerned about is how much it will pull back and forth. Actually, it sits on there pretty good because of those little points on there. Okay, let's try. zip ties. Can we see that all right? All right. So what I'm thinking is, is we zip tie through the little air ducts right here. Seems how the propellers aren't going to be spinning anyways. Propellers, props, whatever. Don't yell at me. Uh, yeah. Right? <laughs> Probably. <laughs> uh, what do you think? Start with the front first? Oh gosh, stay on there. So what I'm thinking is, as we go through the and around the whole body of the car. Oops. All right, now I got to realign everything. Oh, that felt pretty good.
And once I get to getting the steering, so it could go all the way up here, but I'm afraid it might get in the steering a little bit. I'm going to try to pull it back some and go under the body there. And what I'm trying to do is, I don't know if you can see that in there, but the little plastic nib of what holds the body on the uh, little car going through the air vent right there where my middle finger is. Okay, let's see if we can't squish this down. Stay there. Stay there. Well, sounds good. Feels pretty good. Okay. I think I'm going to do one more through the back set of prop vents as well. Sure, I'm not blocking the battery cables. Okay. Ooh, is that going to be all right? Yeah, looks all right. Got to make sure I'm not cover the power button. <laughs> Check that out. So there's the zip ties going around it. I may, I may zip ties those together just so this one doesn't slip up to the front and come loose. But there is how it sits on top of the quad car here. <laughs> Neat. Check that out. <laughs> Uh, I think this might actually work. I don't know if the DJI signal is going to be too strong and just murder the control signal. Probably not. Probably not. Okay. Uh, what else do we need to do? Uh, maybe zip tie the bottom ones like we were talking about. Yeah, there we go. So I zip tied those together so this one can't slip up on the top over the steering. Okay. Uh, time to cut these free. Yes. Do I want to cut those? Do I care? I don't care. I'm not going to cut those. Okay. Uh, so now it's time to plug it all in and, oh goodness, oh it came loose, there we go, okay. Uh, and see if it actually works. I think I'm going to actually try that uh, out at the park. <laughs> I'll be back. So this feels like the second bad idea is coming to the park with a bunch of RC parts. <laughs> we have the Latrax and we have the DJI Neo strapped to the top of it. Let's see if we can get them turned on and see if they'll work. <laughs> okay, plug it in. All right, let's get less of me. What do you think? <laughs> Definitely less of me. Okay, uh, so now I gotta get my goggles set up right. It actually looks really good. I'm gonna start recording. All right, so now I can set this down and then turn on this one. Oh, <laughs> there we go. Check that out.
Check that out. Well, that guy's cool. Look how cool that guy is. <laughs> Whoa! No! It works! Uh, it's a little shaky. Dude, this is amazing! <laughs> Are you seeing any of this? A little bit, maybe? <laughs> Check that thing out. Uh, mission successful. <laughs> uh, okay, uh, so it wasn't a bad idea. It was a brilliant idea. Um, so I'm going to keep racing this. Uh, I love you guys. Bye. <laughs>